friends, Trinis, countrymen, this is On The Record and this is your boy Dennis T. Allen and tonight we have a very special show talking about one of my favorite sports, auto sports and the state of the whole realm from karting to motorbike racing, everything. Some of you all would know me on a personal level, a lot of my friends watch this show, you all would know that from day one, I've been an auto sports fan. Growing up, hanging out with the Sedano brothers, we always go Sunday evening, pack up dad's car, go in the back of the gallant, and we up the road, heading out to Wallerfield. Jag racing, circuit racing, anything to do with a car, we in that. We always like peeling out, what? Pop the clutch, what? We love that. Been driving since I was 16. Now, I'm slightly older than that. And it's a sport that I've seen decline over the years. And we have a strong, proud history in this sport. And tonight we're gonna to find out from Jameer Ali, the Vice President of the Trinidad and Tobago Autosports Association, and another good friend of mine, Rodney Granado. Welcome, gentlemen. This is on the record. So whatever you say, remember, it had to go on the record. So make sure you keep it clean. No cussing. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so fellas, what's going on? Talk to me about what is going on in auto sports in Trinidad right now. Well, Give uh, me the pitch. Right now, uh, our uh, organization, the Trinidad and Tobago Automobile Sports Association, is a new management where uh, Robert Amaro is the president. I am the vice president. and We have Rada as the secretary, uh, and we still have Selwyn Passada as the FIA delegate. Right. right. Now, it's important that we understand that this is not for one type of reason. This is the umbrella. Right, so this uh -huh. is the FIA for, for, uh, affiliate That's for right. auto sport. That's right. Yeah, we um, mm -hmm. we basically uh, the just like football, you have uh, FIFA. Mm -hmm. All right, uh, Trinidad Big Automobile Sports Association is the FIA representative for motorsport in Trinidad. So once it have a motor and it racing, call you. Call me. Yeah. All right. <laughs> so. Rodney, you're the editor of Car Talk magazine, and of course, you're the host of the very popular I Love My Rides. So what's been going on with, um, with that show? Oh, well, basically, we're in the 10th season. Um, seen my partner moving, John, ex cameraman here. Right, you know, right. Out of right. Sports, you know, I see a lot of friendly faces, and you know what it is, B. Um, just trying to keep it together, keep grounded. 10 years, I just trying to give back to the people, because I the kind of follow them. I now just came back from. Um, Las Vegas, Seymour Car Show. Big, my big, second, Seymour Car Show. Talk to Ken Block, the drifting legend. He actually was um, trying to promote Jim Connor 6 and I tried to persuade him to come to the Caribbean to record Jim Connor 6 in the Caribbean. He was looking at Jamaica, Barbados, and even Trinidad to probably do drifting on Maracas Beach, um, coming down in the stretch, and then eat a bacon shark. Um, I mean, that is, and he's a gazillionaire. <laughs> I mean, last year when I met him, I was so shocked that he has so much money. He owns DC clues, DC shoes, DC sports apparel, and he's just all over the world. And he's just like, what, um, the thing about him is a adrenaline junkie. He's in snowboarding, X Games, Google Rallycross, he's in drifting, and he's just trying to support the young generation, trying to bring them up. And I even met um, Daniel Murphy, she's the queen of Europe, she's a drift champion as well. And uh, Snoop Dogg, I mean, we met people in the custom car show business, and what I admire in the US was the family vibes, right? And you know, I just trying to bring the back that family vibes here and just try to support um, everybody in motorsport, everybody in the car show stuff. Because if you ask Jimmy here or even Frank in the, in the background there, you would see many carting, you would see many drifting, you would see many drag racing, see many circuit racing. Well, you don't have any right now. But what I'm saying, the car show, yeah. And That's why you're here tonight. Just trying to jump up all in the Caribbean and stuff, you know. But um, at the same time with my show, I try to promote the road safety. Because um, I used to be racing on the streets and I stopped it, right? And um, road safety is really important. I survived two accidents. So trying to bring all that back to the Car Talk magazine and we have road safety. But, at least, but, as, but still try to promote motorsport because it's a billion dollar industry worldwide. It's, it's only when you leave China and you go away, you realize how, much the, big it, how big it is. Met Sebastian Vettel, met Sebastian Loeb last year, World Rally Champion. Met him, we went to Spain, we went to Europe last year, England. Um, you also met a host, host of people, whoever. Came back from Brazil this year, met some Formula One drivers. And the thing about it is that it's a billion dollar industry. And I would really like to see it in Trinidad. And anyway, I could try to help whoever promoted through the media 
or you know, just moral support, just being around the guys and just trying to learn from them because a lot of people have a lot of information, a lot of experience, a lot of history that you as a young fellow can work on and build on. And you know, just try to help, help the other people come up. Word. Well, there you have it. That is the foundation for what's going to be on the record tonight. We're going to take a little break and come right back at you with more Auto Sports Room. Tonight.